Hello, my name is Walter Unglob, and this is What is in the Center of the Nucleus in an Atom? An atom is a composite particle, meaning that it's comprised of multiple uh, more fundamental constituents, such as an electron and this nucleus, which is made up, generally speaking, of neutrons and protons. So the protons are denoted by the letter P, and the neutrons are denoted by the letter N. And both the neutrons and the protons are known as nucleons. And more specifically, they're known as baryons. And a baryon is any composite subatomic particle that is made up of three quarks, in which the quark is an elementary particle in the standard model of particles and fields. So a proton will be made up of two up quarks and one down quark, and these all interact. And a neutron, which is the other type of baryon that is found in normal matter, will be made up of two down quarks and one up quark. So if you look at the center of the nucleus, you'll just find a bunch of protons and neutrons, and they're held together by the strong nuclear force, just like these quarks are bound together in the strong nuclear force. And the mediating particle that is responsible for this type of interaction is known as a gluon, and just like the photon, it is also massless. It is a boson, meaning it has integer spin, unlike the quarks, which are fermions, which means they have half integer spin. So inside of the nucleus, in the center, you'll find a bunch of quarks and a bunch of gluons. And there's a lot of uh, energy density, which makes up most of the mass inside. It's due to these interactions uh, that allows the nucleus to be stable inside. And when you have too many protons, then you have the electromagnetic force that will cause the nucleus to be unstable. But these three types of particles are primarily the uh, types of elementary particles that will be found in the center of an atom. My name is Walter Unglob, and this is What is in the Center of the Nucleus in an Atom? Thank you.